big salute, big salute, big salute, big salute, big salute. Mm. 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 Love one, support goon, support squad. Love y'all. You know I love y'all. Hey, and remember, use your big stick while speaking gently. Big salute to them queens out there. Mm, it's a lot of y'all, y'all. Warrior queens. Because y'all be talking y'all shit, boy. Yeah, 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 the warrior queens. Y'all know who y'all is. Y'all know who y'all is. Them warrior queens. Love y'all. Forgive me if I'm looking rough. I'm, I'm trying to get my mind back ready because I think well, we might be back in the wilderness. Y'all might be back with me. So if y'all been keeping up, y'all already know how to halfway live in the wilderness. You know, but uh, yeah, I might be back in the wilderness. I don't know yet. I don't know what God got in store, but that's what it's looking like. Because these current events in the world, man, we don't know how shit going to go. We don't know how shit going to go. We don't know. We don't know. We don't know. Because what things, it seemed at first it was every couple months. Then it got to every couple weeks. Now it's like every couple of days it's something new. From war to famine. They people talking about ain't no water, ain't no food, uh, uh supplies backed up. Why? It's it's a plan going on, y'all. It's a plan. They it's a plan going on. It's a plan going on. So prepare, prepare, prepare. Like, share, subscribe, prepare, prepare, prepare. And y'all stay tuned, man. Be ready for anything. Stay paranoid. Stay prayed up. Yeah, it's that time. So let's let's get into it. Chapter 30. You know, chapter 30. She had become the habitation of devils. Revelations 18:2. She had become the habitation of devils. Habitation of devils has she become. Woo! This is America. The glory of the world and wealth. Sport and play. With her merchant ships plaguing the high seas, carrying her costly merchandise throughout the population of the nations of the earth. Bible. Revelations chapter 18, verse 19. The ships of America can be seen everywhere in every port of the nations of earth. Her great navy is built to command the high seas. Her decks are mounted with great bristling rifle-barreled guns. The decks of her ships are covered with planes with which to carry deadly bombshells to pour on other nations who dare now to reject her entrance into their waters. Woo! The writer, John, foresaw, the writer John foresaw America threatening and daring the nations to disobey her order to allow her entrance. America's, America's Navy planes fly high in the air with their deadly bombs held ready to drop on the towns and cities of other nations who dare to attack her. The sky over America is shadowed with thousands of planes, but yet the grievous destruction awaits America. America sends planes flying out of her country and shoots herself out into space by means of the modern rockets designed for space. Travel. At home, America's country is as the prophet foresaw and prophesied of it. America is covered with planes and her army is standing ready to stop inside a rebellion. The prophet who foresaw all this, all of this, readies in preparation for the world showdown of military might, says, Woe to the land, shadowing with wings. Bible, Isaiah chapter 18, verse 1. America takes a look around the dead piece of our earth. Well, with wings, Bible, I, I said Isaiah, but it said I-S dot 18-1. So I'm assuming that's Isaiah. America takes a look around the dead piece of our earth, the moon. 
She wants to see if they can do her harm. America takes a look at Venus and Mars to see if there are signs of any gods on these planets who are capable of war warring with her. Amer yeah, Space Force, Google it. America has boasts of her ability to kill the civilization of Earth three times over and have an army left to attack anywhere else that an enemy may rise up against her. Nebuchadnezzar and Belshazzar, who were the world rulers of their day and time, made great boasts. Pharaoh also made great mock of Allah, Jehovah, and his power to attack Pharaoh in the in his power to attack Pharaoh. In the Holy Quran, Pharaoh said to Moses, in the Holy Quran, Pharaoh said to Moses concerning Allah the Lord of the Worlds, chapter 20, uh, C, well, C-H-A-P, verse 20, uh, chapter 19, verse 49. So I'm, so chap, I wonder what, what's chap. I don't think I got the uh, 20 yet in my Quran. So I see who chap is. I don't got my Quran with me, so, so C-H-A-P, 20, 49. Who is your Lord, O Moses? Pharaoh said to his slave, Moses, in words to say, you take another God besides me. Holy Quran, CH 20, 71. So I, Pharaoh, shall cut off your hands and feet on opposite sides. But Israel took another God, Allah, Jehovah, besides Pharaoh, and they did not lose their hands and feet on opposite sides. The people cry about death and destruction pl playing havoc over America, but they never cry about the evil that they are committing and which is the cause of the destruction coming into her borders, bringing floods, rain, ice, hail, and earthquakes, daily and nightly, somewhere on the surface of the land of America. Yep. Prayers up for Kentucky. The Bible refers to America by the name Babylon and teaches us Revelations chapter 18, verse 2. Babylon the Great is fallen, is fallen, and is become the habitation of devils and the whole of every foul spirit and a cage of every unclean and hateful bird. This is true, for America has accepted immigrants of the most evil and lewd character from Europe. America has filled her country with evil and indecency, and there is no good in the works of America. America hates the doers of good and seeks to destroy them. This is the cause of the fall of America. You can bear witness to the deadly storms and twisters, tornadoes, that are striking America in the areas where some of you live. Can you not see that Allah God is after you for the evil done to his people, black man, the rich, the wealthy and powerful rulers of America, from the mayors of cities, the police commissioners, up to the president, work to oppose the black once slaves return to his own. All of this hastens their doom. As the Bible, palms, P.S. It says P.S. My mom assuming his palms. Uh, chapter 2, verse 4. Teaches us, He that sitteth in the heavens shall laugh. The Lord shall have them in derision. D-E-R-I-S-I-O-N. D-E-R-I-S-I-O-N. I, I got to go look that up. Der derision. The Lord shall have them in derision. Allah God laughs at their struggle to bring to a knot his aims and purpose of freedom, justice, and equality to his black people. Allah God has them, has them heads of America, in derision. There go again, D-E-R-I-S-I-O-N. In derision and confusion to the limit of their wits. 
In another place, the Bible teaches us that he, Allah, will turn them backwards. Uh, I think it's Isaiah. It says, I-S, chapter 44, verse 25. So I'm assuming that's Isaiah. Evil and filth are the God and worship of America. Never has a people on earth, never has a people on the face of the earth become so bold in their evil practices. <sighs> Big facts. Never before America has there been a nation on the face of the earth where scores of murders take place daily and nightly. Woo! In one large metropolitan city of America, the death rate is terrific. Children kill children, male is against male, and female is against female, destroying each other. Boy, ain't that going on right now? Y'all know this book was written in like the 50s, 40s, 50s, 60s? The woman has no shyness. American designers and manufacturers dress the woman up in about one third of a dress and turn her out partially nude, titties and ass out. Before the public, you would not accept to witness this in a country that preaches Christ Jesus and has churches dotting here and there throughout the land. You can hardly walk two or three blocks in a city without walking into the door of a church. The Christians profess to be the most truly righteous people in the country. All night long, their verses are heard on the air preaching Jesus Christ the prophet who lived 2,000 years ago. He is dead and cannot hear the prayers of anyone, not even his own. The Christian preachers try to fool you by telling you that if you pray to the prophet Jesus, that he will hear you. This is false. He cannot hear you. If it were true, why cannot they get him to hear them when they call for peace anywhere? Their doctrine is used to deceive black man so that he will stay on his knees praying to something for which he will never get an answer. He will never get an answer from a dead prophet. What kind of little girl can accept from a mother who is walking around one half naked and is displaying herself to the world dressed in such a dress that no animal would wear? There is more shyness in shyness displayed in animals than there is in the so-called Christian America, dressed in a mini dress. What the truth hurt, don't it? What the words hurt, don't it? Because it's so true. So true. The black woman should be too proud of herself to disgrace herself in the same manner as her white slave mistress. Ooh. The black man should be sent to prison for being such a fool as to allow his wife and daughter to go out and show their new selves to the public. Smack all y'all boys upset upside the head who let your old lady see how Kim did uh, Kanye. That's why Kanye left. You shouldn't have built me up like this, Kanye. Yeah, I'm, I'm sexy. You got my confidence way up there. Yeah, nudity originated from the white race. Now they want to say the world that I am the guide. The guide to what? The Holy Quran says that they lead you to nothing but filth and evil. The Bible is referring to the people of America when it is referring to the people of Sodom and Gomorrah. Allah God destroyed them when he saw that it was good to do so. Genesis, G-E-N, chapter 19, verse 13. As it was with Sodom and Gomorrah, so it will be with America. Ooh, shit, boy. True hurt, don't it? Cut deep, cut deep. Cut deep, cut deep. And it's so true because I'm from there. I know what it is. You can't lie to me. You can't tell me it ain't true. I'm from there. Yeah, I, I used to love, I love, I used to love, sometimes I even catch myself every now and then. Man. Chapter 30, she has become the habitation of devils. Delay. Hey 
that what they be doing? Yeah, that's that's popular now, right? That's popular now, right? Big salute, big salute, big salute. I hope you got the message. Every member. Use your big stick while speaking gently. <laughs> message.